Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Let's Play Barn Finders. My name is Weasel, and we are back. What do you think about the moon landing? I don't know, Agent Agent. I have to sell some stuff. Uh, sorry, I walked backwards. Anyways, we have to sell a bunch of stuff because I want to go to Lumber Mill Barn to look for the Dimension Slicer. Don't worry about it. I know it's weird. But we need $10,000 to be able to buy it, I assume, in an auction on site. So we'll be spending some time just selling some stuff to fellas like Bobby gray over here. Yeah, sure. Go ahead. You can have it just like that. I'm not even gonna haggle. I have so much stuff. And I got an achievement. Bank robber daddy. I don't even know what that means. Well, I hope that I'll be able to sell this bad boy. $1,500 for the tractor. I still can't get over the fact that she's gonna use her hand to threaten me when she successfully buys something. That's the weirdest choice for a happy, successful transaction. I know we have a bunch of stuff in storage that we could assemble. Wow, we have so much stuff that needs assembling. Oh yeah, let's repair this flat screen TV. Just whack it with a hammer a few times and you'll be good to go. I'll be right with you customers. I'm just doing magic right now. All right, let's put you on this play. And yes, you can have that and come on, before you disappear, let's sell it. There you go. They're so impatient. They come into the store and a few seconds later, they're gonna leave again. You really gotta be on guard for this stuff. How about we wash the bogus wood, that barber chair that looks super awesome awesome. Ooh, snazzy. Let's get it nice and clean. I wonder how much this levitating cleaning platform would be worth. I imagine that's where the real money is to be made. Just sell that thing off to some private company that will research it and, and give you millions for it. Okay, is that one clean yet? I guess it's clean. Nope, never mind. It's not clean. Son of a gun. There you go. I was wondering. Mm, like new. Okay, let's repair this huge cola machine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we'll just leave it sticking there. Come with me. Okay, maybe I have to go the other way around. Uh, this one's finicky. All right, get some stuff to sell. I like how it says Broken Zone. It's the alternative title for my channel. Welcome to the Broken Zone. My name is Ruined. I think that would be a good name for the Broken Zone. Huh, I wonder if this was Uncle Billy. Just seeing the poster here. Ooh, someone wants to buy the tractor. Yes, please. Bring me closer. Let's see if I can haggle a few hundred dollars out of you. Two thousand. $25. Nearly got 10000 I still have to buy the gas to get to that location. But given that we've been lucky in buying the other location with less money, I hope that this will be enough. 8700 You know what? Let's try it. I have to at least try. I can always come back and earn more money. I wonder what's hiding in here. Maybe it's Area 51. Oh, you know what? Now that I'm seeing those signs, I'm not even, I'm not even completely sure that that's not the case. I'm gonna ignore all the junk outside and I'm just gonna go and start the auction. Oh, we're starting at 6,000? Okay, this might be a little bit tricky to pull off. Yup, most certainly not going to happen. Oh, well, maybe more like the second time around? It's interesting that this time there's only 25 and $50 increments. I wonder if that is somewhat of a buck if you restart the auction that the increments are sl smaller and the NPCs are gonna bid less. Just guessing here, I'm not gonna bid a single dollar until the time starts running out. Oh man, this thing is lasting forever now. And here I was hoping that the small increments are gonna reduce the price, but it just increases the time. Tell you what, we're going back. I'm not gonna sit through another five minutes. There's still plenty of stuff to be sold. Nice shop. Well, that's the first time you said something nice about it. He's still not buying anything. Chicken, come here. Chicken, chicken, come here. You're gonna have to greet the customers. Here, you sit here and you greet the customers. Ooh, this sale might be the only thing that I still need, and we have $10,000. Good enough for me. And even got an achievement, material focus. All right, back to Lumber Mill Barn. Now I should have enough to purchase it. Let's hope that we have more luck this time. Son of a gun. Ugh. All right, I guess it was worth to go through it in the small steps. And uh, we're only paying 9,200. Ultimately, I would have said, yeah, make more money so you can go through the auction faster. But you know what? That's all right. Okay, so we bought this piece of junk. I mean, 
you know, pretty safe to say that's what that is. The question is, though, what is it hiding? Man, all of this wooden furniture looks actually really good. A nice wooden table like that, I mean, you don't have a key. Well, and let's find a key. I always feel like having an axe should be an automatic key. Let's see, maybe something's in the shipping container? Well, just more wooden furniture. I can see... A wall skin. Mmm, wall skin made out of human leather. Oh, is there a second... Oh, there's a second floor. Or just a balcony, I guess. Not quite a whole floor. Uh, nice old TV. Caked and whatever. Hmm. You know what? This almost looks like I could jump over there. Nope, that's not happening. Hmm. But we can certainly open it up with a lockpick. I mean, this flimsy little door, I could have just pushed that wooden board and be through it. No problem. Okay, an old cash register. Very neat. A set of keys for the basement. And a bunch more trash that I'm not going to collect just now. Okay, let's make room. Let's check out the basement. Part of me is expecting an Independence Day style underground bunker. Oh, 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 okay. Yeah, kind of close-ish. Hi, are we just going into an alien dimension? Bring this bottle to our leader, Bobby. Okay, buddy. I added something extra to the moonshine. I'm so glad you did. <sighs> All right, time to go into an alternate dimension or travel across the universe. Oh, or space station. One of those. Welcome, Barn Finder. Our leader's waiting for you. Yes, alien. You look just like your other friend. Mm, okay, those are all the locations, or at least a few of those on the cameras. Uncle Billy is uh, green. The other models are all red. I don't know why, though, what that indicates. It might not indicate anything, but here we have a chicken. Holographic chicken. It is accumulation of all our scientific efforts. Displaying running chicken in hologram form. Be amazed human. Ooh, got ourselves a, well, a sword. I'm not entirely sure what kind of sword, but it's called the saber tooth, which is pretty snazzy. Wow, look at this alien base. It's pretty cool. Look, excuse me, what is that? I assume you're just trying to construct something out of hands? That ain't good. That's a weird mask. Okay, you know what? I'll just be uh, going down here. Is this where you worship the moonshine? Our galaxy moonshine was stolen. We need a new bottle. Well, I just got the thing for you. No moonshine, no party. I don't want to die as a virgin. Something blocks this door. Sure it does. What about the other side. Nope, also blocked. Hey, what's going on over here? Uh, I'll take this guitar if you don't mind. I saw this dance one. Earth is fun. Please stop doing this. Please, for the love of God. Just no, no. Oh man, somebody had to animate this. Okay, so how do I get, how do I get to the alien leader? I'm not even weirded out anymore by being in a weird alien base. This is just everyday business. Ooh, oh, over there. To the disco, the space disco. I'll be selling this. Ooh, teleporting into the space disco. Oh, this is kind of, this is kind of bumming me out. Please bring the moonshine over here. Oh, hey, Bobby, are you, are you the leader of the aliens? I just realized you were wearing uh, sneakers. We live for moonshine. I'm so glad your civilization is based on alcohol. See you later, my friend. Wait, wait, are I, I got a ticket? What's that about? Woo! The party's back! Uncle Billy, are you dancing with the aliens down? Yes. Uncle Billy's dancing with the aliens down there. Well, you know, for aliens, they got some pretty sweet moves. Gotta give them that. Shouldn't there be like, I don't know, aliens dancing on the weird platform? Oh, now the door's open. Where will they lead us? Oh, oh, this one just brought me back. Excuse me? <laughs> just boxes flying around. Well, I didn't find the dimension slot. I don't know what I need it for, but I'm not gonna leave without it. Okay, this seems to be the spot. Goodbye, suckers. Hey, did you abduct this crocodile slash alligator? I don't know how I feel about that. Oh, piggies. Oh, this, no, okay, for a second I was like, oh, they're dead. Bernard, Bernard, can you hear me? Wait, did you transform one of your alien friends into, oh, they locked my cousin by mistake. Wait, did you turn one of your alien friends into a pig? All right, I'm just gonna let you be, and I'm just is gonna be going this way. Okay, we got some frozen deer. They're completely immovable. Oh, I will get my revenge, Bobby Gray. What plot are we gonna be unraveling?
unraveling here. Also, there's just a bag of peanuts. Well, we made it to the back room. <gasps> Ooh, UFO. Are we going to be able to bring this home? <laughs> yes. Let's transport it home and sell it. I'll just be transporting your uh, UFO out of here if you don't mind. You're not going to need that, right? Nah, you'll be fine without it. Okay, so where do I go next? Seems to me there's some sort of control room I'd like to get into. I'm not sure how I'm going to accomplish that feat. I feel like I'm missing an important clue. Oh, we found a floor upgrade, so that's neat. Excuse me, what's going on here? There's just stuff being funneled into the various spots. And down it goes. Plop. Hmm, no idea what that is about. Where is that dimension slicer? And why do I want a dimension slicer? Oh, did the client want that? Entirely possible. Oh, I think I found the job item. Just right over here. Totally missed that. It's such a small little item. Well, I'll take it. Thank you very much. Oh, there's probably more stuff to be found here. I haven't come across the toilet paper, which is probably hiding somewhere. But I'm kind of too curious about the dimension slicer. So I kind of want to wrap that one up and see if we maybe even unlock another location of sorts or get some sort of ending. There's definitely stuff falling from the sky. It's very weird. All right, going back to the pawn shop. Yep, just, just load up the UFO. Yep, I bet nobody would even bat an eye if they saw that. They would just think, ah, it's a prop. I still have a harder time believing that someone would buy a used plastic sex doll over us finding an UFO. All right, let's unload the truck and let's send off the dimension slicer to see what's gonna happen. And pack and send. Got a new email. Kinda a dog. Yo, yo, cuz. So I really want a thick boy to make a company. Last time saw one was around Knuckles Barn. Get him cash. See ya Christmas. 1,200 and we unlocked Knuckles Barn. Where would that be? Ooh, 345 square foot barn of traditional Slavic construction. I guess we're gonna check that out in the next episode. There's also the Beaver Wars. Well, the Bid Wars Beaver event. But I'll leave that for later. We're gonna go to Knuckles Barn in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, make sure to drop a like. I'm Weasel, I'm out, and I hope to see you around. Bye bye. Bow, 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 bow,